Happy birthday. So, when are you finishing that? I I'm not sure. I feel like there's something missing. Going out with the guys tonight? Might buy you something nice. No need. Nah. It's your birthday, babe. Or might just give you something else when I come back. The whiskey on your breath could make a small boy dizzy. But I hung on like death. Such waltzing was not easy. We romped until the pans slid from the kitchen shelf. The hand that held my wrist was battered on one knuckle. At every step, you missed my right ear scraped buckle. You beat time on my head with a palm caked hard by dirt and waltzed me off to bed, still clinging to your shirt. Theodore Roth. But you need to go have a shower, okay? Yes, shower. Babe, no. Uh, no, baby, come on. No, car just stop. Uh, look, look, I, I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I, I was just. I, I do everything for you. And this, this is how you fucking repay me. Look, I, I, I'm sorry. I didn't mean. In the mood. You're not in the mood, huh? Yeah. What am I supposed to do, huh? Answer me! Fuck. Fuck. Why don't you love me, huh? I, I do. Bullshit. But he's here all night. You want to come in? I don't have any money on me. It's okay. Coffee's on me. So, I like your sketches. Thanks. What do they mean? Nothing. I just do whatever comes to mind. I don't believe that. I believe that every painting has some sort of meaning that comes from somewhere deep within the artist. And what makes you the expert? Am I right or am I wrong? It's a dream. What's a dream about? It starts off with me being underwater. I feel light. I'm wearing a white long dress on. I don't question the fact I'm underwater. Everything's blue. I'm wearing a beautiful light dress on. She looks at me like the way she used to. The smile, the light in her eyes. She gets closer and closer. 
the lips touch mine. I feel loved, filled with happiness, just like the past. Wow, that's wonderful. How's she now? She changed. A lot. Here. Just call me if you need someone to talk to. Christina. Where's my coffee? I've been waiting for an hour now. Sir, I understand, but... Excuse me, sir. Hello? Hey. Oh, hey, Christina. What's up? Is everything okay? Yeah, just wanted to thank you for giving me your number. And for the free coffee. Oh, yeah, sure, no problem. Are you sure everything's okay? No, no, I was just about to close the shop. What's up? Carter went out with her friends and I'm... I'm just here finishing a painting. Okay, do you want me to come over? Uh, we can talk. Who were you? I was at a coffee shop. Alone? Mm -hmm. You sure? Mm -hmm. Going out tonight. When I'm back, I want you to take a shower. It's my like coffee. Be careful with the drinks. not telling me what to do. Wasn't well, where you're paying the rent, Christina. You are nothing without me. Finish that thing for fuck's sake. We met at the cafe. She was with her friends. I own my own sketching. A typical Friday night for me. Until she caught my attention. She turned and looked at me. I thought she was like all the other women I've met in my life, so I ignored her. A part of me wanted to know her, though. A part of me felt that she was different. And I was suddenly interested to know her. Right when I turned my eyes back to her smile, that's when I felt it. Love. I felt love. When she kissed me, I felt this warm brush in my heart. You're wrong. You don't know her like I do. You don't have to go back there. You can stay with me. Thank you, but I will have to kindly decline.
out again, babe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Lot, lots of work. Uh, how was work? Alone? Yes, yes, alone. You sure? Uh, uh, babe, I, I was thinking of making your favourites tonight. I know how much you love my pasta. I really don't want to do this. But you leave me no choice. What? What is it, babe? You are adorable. And I really don't want to lose you, Christina. You won't. Kasa, you won't. You won't. Kasa, babe, I love you. I, I love you. Who's Nick? No, look, baby, look, it, it, it's not what you think. Look, let me explain, honey. After everything I've done for you. No, no, baby, look. <laughs> Sweetie, he's just a friend. You know what I hate more than cheaters? Liars. But I'm telling the truth. <laughs> Kaza, Kaza, please, what are you doing? Super stuck. You know I love you, right? If you love me so much, why do you drown me? If you love me so much, why do you hurt me? Because I love you. And I don't want to lose you. Well, you already have. Baby, come on! No, we are done! I, Christina! Do it. Go ahead. Hit me. That's what I thought. Whatever. I didn't love you anyways. I know. I realize that now. They always tell you that forgiveness is the key to recovery. Maybe that's true. But it's not the type of forgiveness they are thinking of. It's not about forgiving her. It's about forgiving myself and living without the guilt that consumes me. understand what fresh air feels like because when you're underwater constantly drowning you don't get the chance to experience what fresh air feels like it's time to leave to You paid for the drink this time. No, but seriously, thank you for helping me understand. It was not just me, Christina. You stood up for yourself. Seriously, how did you do it? I simply just remembered the words you told me. I couldn't have fixed that. It was a relational suicide on my behalf. I just... I feel bad that I didn't leave her earlier, you know? 
It's better late than never. Just remember, every scar tells a story. A story that says, I have survived. Never forget that. I want to hear you say it. I survived. Suspicious, you keep dreaming and dark skin.